Morning all, welcome back. Well, another assault, a verbal assault this time this morning. If I hadn't got out of his way, I'd have got physically assaulted. What a nut job. I've seen this bloke around town. You know when you look at him and you think, that bloke's a nutter. <laughs> yeah, you're usually right. Anyway, starts, I was at the top of the 199 steps. I've come on, I'm at, I'm at the Whitby Holiday Park this morning, which is a caravan, it's for tourers, it's for statics, as you can see, and they've got some nice uh, wooden cabins, you know, those, uh, what do they call them? When uh, glamping type things. Very nice up here, very pleasant. It's on uh, part. It's sited partly on the Cleveland Way, so you can walk in from Whitby. And I was, I was actually at St Mary's Church at the top of the 199 steps, and these two people came up. Uh, the, uh, they were both, yeah, yeah, complete oh, blood video and effing and blinding it and all of this, you know. I said, "What are you talking about, me?" He said, "Yeah, you." <laughs> And, uh, yeah, ruining the town, yeah, incomers, you know, this white settler thing won't go away. People are always abusing you about it. So he's coming at me, so I got out of the way. I said, get a hell away from me. Keep away from me. Now, I've got him on film, but I'm not going to put it on here because he's, he's not worth the space, time of day. He's not worth the space. But I've, I've got him on video, and, I, you know, I don't want to aggravate matters. I'm not like that, really, but... Uh, yeah, it's disarming when people do that, and it's happening on a fairly regular basis, and I'm not quite sure what the hell to do about it. But anyway, I suppose I just keep on keeping on. So today, uh, I'm up at the uh, Whitby Holiday Park. I've come up here. I'm going to walk the other way into town, back on the Cleveland Way. Here comes a car. Uh, back on the Cleveland Way, uh, back into Whitby, back to the top of the 199 steps. My mate Richard says, I've got to stop playing music and just start talking about stuff. <laughs> and he's probably right <laughs> so I'm going to have a walk on here and uh, yeah I'll probably just do a bit of audio over it instead of putting music on and let's see how we get on so Whitby Holiday Park we're on the Cleveland Way and we're going to walk back into Whitby back to the top of the 199 steps right let's pause right mates let's get on as you can see they've got some of these glam camping uh, things up here i think they've just put two new ones up as well uh if you walk behind me you can see robin hood's bay uh, uh and then you, there's a there's a path down to saltwick uh, bay saltwick nab is it nab saltwick bay uh footpath down there and if you remember i did a video quite some time about one of the wrecks down there so it's it's interesting it's not a great footpath to walk down so if you're not so good on your feet then uh, i'll be uh i tread with caution as i say but um yeah, it's a nice campsite up here. There's not wrong with it at all. And it's forever expanding. They've just put this, I don't know what this wooden one is here, whether it's a rentable one or people live in it. I guess it's one to rent, who knows. Um, but it's very well kept, lovely and clean. They used to have a clubhouse in here. See this building right in front of me? They used to have a clubhouse in here. But I don't know whether they do or don't. Let's go have a look, eh? But I know they've got a bar which is called a jet bar, jet coffee. I'm going to show you that in a minute. So I don't know where they've got a bar in here. They probably still have. Why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't you? Looks like it. Have they got... Let's have a look through the window. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Don't seem so, does it? And then they used to have a little cafe in here. Well, that don't look like... Uh, and then it says beer garden round there. But they've got this place here, which I think is called the Jet Bar. Jet Bar? Yes, the Jet Bar. I think in Whitby Jet. That's what they're getting at, isn't it? Uh, I don't know when it's open. I've been up a few times and it's not been open. Well, let's have a look at hours of open closed. So if you're thinking about coming up, there it is. And if you want to have a look at the sandwiches and stuff, there you go. Main scampi chips and peas, £8.50. Beast lasagna and chips, £8.50. It's all £8.50. Saltwick burger, £8.50. Can't go wrong, can you? 
So do you think I can walk back into Whitby without getting assaulted again? <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I need danger money. You don't have shake up, you know, when people start coming at you. You know, I'm too old for uh, brawling in the street. I'm not right good at it, to be honest with you, either. Right, let's have a little walk down here and uh, avoid getting people on camera. And then uh, just show you, good morning, I'll just show you a few things. Uh, there's a nice little play area for the kiddy winkies. So if you've got the grandkids with you, you can come up and push them on the swing for hours on end because they don't want to get off and bawl their eyes out when you tell them they have to. <laughs> Then you've got to bribe them with something. <laughs> Come on, we'll go for an ice cream. <laughs> yeah, and then the little faces pick up, don't they? You know, oh, ice cream. <laughs> yeah, I've conned him into an ice cream. <laughs> Silly old fool, sorry. Somebody behind me in the car. I'll get out of the way. That looks nice, doesn't it? That looks lovely. That's pod six. Swift, that's who my sister deals with. She does uh, all of their uh, mattresses, bedding type stuff for Swift. It's interesting, isn't it? Now they've just put this new little uh, little thing in. So, uh, yeah, I don't know what it is. Maybe they're going to put some uh, goldy fish in it. I don't know. Right, let's pause there, shall we? And uh, tell you what, we'll have, a, uh, we'll have a walk down and we'll show you the Cleveland way and the walk back into Whitby. Right, we're right on the edge of the caravan uh, park here. Oh, a holiday park. It's not a caravan park, it's a holiday park. Apologies for that. It is a holiday park. It's where people come for holidays. So you've got some beautiful views. The Solwick Bay uh, behind me. And then down here. And let's get up some of these steps. We'll have a little bit of a walk up here. And uh, we'll show you what's going on when we get to the top. I'm going to have to break this up into little uh, snippets of videos because one, we're way too long, and secondly, I think my battery will run out. I'm, I'm filming on this Insta uh, Insta 360 Ace Pro. Wonderful camera, I must admit. Wonderful camera. Come on, lad. Oh, can you hear my knees cracking? <laughs> If you can't, I'm surprised. Oh, oops, nearly bit the dust then. <laughs> what am I doing? Nearly falling on the floor, getting assaulted. Oh man, it just goes on and on and on, doesn't it? Right, as you can see, we're right on the edge of the park here, so. Uh, the holiday park, you see, got it right, the holiday park. And we're going to get walking up, uh, whew, up the Cleveland Way, come on. See, there's some people up there filming on the cameras. I wonder whether that guy's going to come up and start abusing them. I don't know. You've got to be careful when you come on here, you know. Especially as you get further on, because the cliff's eroding. Look at that, mates. It's a sight for sore eyes, isn't it? How many people, when they're in Whitby, come up here and have a look around and lots of the locals come up here, I see, on a quite often regular basis having a walk up here. It'd be nice if that cafe was open at the end, wouldn't it? Could have a stroll on and a, a bun and a cup of coffee or a, a glass of vino collapse or whatever takes your fancy. Who knows? Right, come on, upwards and onwards. Up. Right mates, this is a lovely spot. So as you come round the corner here, you get your first sight of Whitby. Get the pier down there. Get the abbey over there. Get St Mary's, just, just a glimpse of it. Beautiful views, look at that. There's a couple of the herons down there. Wow. What Whitby's all about, isn't it? Isn't that beautiful? <laughs> I think so. You see what I mean about corroding cliffs? Goodness me. You don't want to slip and take a dive down there. I think that bloke would like me to take it. <laughs> oh dear.
Right mates, we're nearly to where you get on to the Cleveland Way, Cleveland Path, Cleveland Walk, whatever you call it. I think it's a Cleveland Way, isn't it? You know what I mean. Uh, and then you can walk on there. You can walk all the way to Robin Hood's Bay on this path. But I warn you, it's a walk. It's a walk and a half. There's a lot of uphill and down dale. So, you know, if, uh, if you're not too good on your feet, got dodgy knees and you trip over a lot like I do then you can always walk on the cinder track and that's a much easier walk and it's a very pleasant walk as well so there's the abbey we're just coming over the brow see there's a couple of vintage ice cream wagons over there can you see them maybe not that's where the Whitby uh, brewery is by the way just behind those buildings we'll have another look over here then the next stop will be where we actually get onto the path. <laughs> Cleveland Way, footpath to Whitby. Well, we're in Whitby, aren't we? <laughs> morning, morning, morning. There we go. I'll show you this one as well. There's a little warning for us all. Coastal erosion. Yeah, coastal erosion. Watch your footsteps, be careful. We don't want no accidents. So here we are, this is where it, uh, you come on. I'll just see where this stone wall is here. This is, I guess, the official, you know, as you get onto the walkway. So if you go from here, you can walk straight down to St. Mary's Church, straight down the 199 steps. And the nearest pub, I think, is the Duke of York. <laughs> For a sherbet or two. And why not? Here we go. Oh, that wind. It's blowing a gale. Oh, there's a few in memoriam on here very sad what can you do and uh, yeah that's it my friends that's the entrance to uh, and the start as far as I'm concerned of the uh, the Cleveland way from Whitby onto Whitby Holiday Park, onto Robin Hood's Bay and beyond. Right, let's get further down and I'll show you where, uh, yeah, I'll get us down to the top of the 199 steps and see where we go from there. Right, there's renovation going on all over the shop, isn't there? There's something going on there with the uh, the building that's at the, uh, at the Abbey. It's a beautiful shot of the Abbey, that, isn't it? You know, all of that's free. All that view, that beautiful view, is free. <laughs> you know, to pay a penny, you can go in, and uh, it's, a, it's a really good tour of the Abbey, if you want to splash the cash a bit. Maybe I'll do that one day, I don't know. Uh, they don't like drones being flown and all of that business, so uh, that's fair enough, isn't it? But yeah, it's a beautiful view. And uh, look, if you want a sherbet before you go down the 199 steps to our left is a Whitby brewery brew house shop tap room and they've got uh, yeah a wood burning uh, pizza oven in there as well so what's not to like So there we go, it's undergoing major renovation. I think they're putting a new roof on that section. I'm not altogether sure. I'm sure there's others on here will tell you all about it. Beautiful little place, isn't it? As I say, it's sacred ground up here, so it's best not to go trampling all over the place. Keep a bit of respect for the deceased and the families, which ain't a bad thing, is it? Oh, nearly tripped up again. <laughs> Here I am trying to be all solemn. 
<laughs> I'm staggering about all over the place. I hope that nut job in round here. This is where uh, yeah, it started after me. See, I don't like to film people. Unless I have to. Right. So let's twizzle this round. So that's it for today, mates. I hope you've enjoyed it. <coughs> yeah, <laughs> it's been different. And I'm cold. And I'm off down to Spoons or somewhere else. Actually, I might go to Mary Antoinette's or Marie Antoinette's. Just down on Church Street. Absolutely lovely coffee in there. And the biggest slice of cake you've seen in the whole of your puff. Thanks for watching, everybody. And I'll see you next time, if I'm still alive. Chin chin. <laughs>